This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, hit that subscribe button. Now let's get right into it. 50 Cent vows to stop trolling now um, after the passing of Kobe Bryant. I said in honor of Kobe. What did he say exactly? Yeah, he won't be trolling people as much anymore. He said something to that effect. He said, I feel like uh, I have to achieve what I want in life now after this. I have to focus. I'm not arguing with anyone any anymore. I'll deal with it another way. If there's a problem, um, then he, you know, gives his condolences to the family. I mean, you know, Kobe was an inspirational person. I don't have to tell you guys. We're, we've all been, I don't care what you do, if you're into basketball or not. I'm not so much into basketball that much, but I'm very inspired by Kobe. Uh, never really met him. I was in his presence one time, but, you know, that was just because I was working with Ron Artest and we... I was when he was on the Rockets uh, and then when he went to the Lakers, I was around Kobe like maybe a handful of times, never said anything because, you know, what the, what's Kobe going to say to me? You know, I was just around and, uh, you know, it, uh, but, you know, as far as from that, just his hard work and determination um, is just inspiring period you know and the way he looks at life was like go forward don't let anything stop you it's amazing um and that's how you should live uh kylie jenner reacts uh to this whole thing she actually flew on that helicopter and rented it many times the same exact helicopter uh as mo as recent as two and a half months ago for dream's birthday that's rob kardashian's uh daughter and uh she said you know rest in peace and the prayers to the f these families i still can't believe this that was the helicopter i would fly on from time to time with that same pilot uh era ara he was such a nice man hold your loved ones close yeah that's it you realize what's important when something like this happens you know because it could happen to any one of us uh crooked eye is sick of lord jamar in his trolling of Eminem. Um, I kind of agree. Lord Jamar, you know, brand newbie and everything. Amazing, right? You know, he's he part of hip hop history. Uh, but what Lord Jamar is going to be known for now is his trolling of Eminem. You know, because brand newbie and had its time very short lived, wasn't as impactful as a lot of other groups, just being honest, okay? Grand Pooba kind of broke off on his own. And, you know, of course, of course, Brand Nubian's important. But it's one of many groups. I mean, it's not Mob Deep or anything like that. They had their moment. You know, it's like Far Side or something like that. You know, like they had their moment. Classic songs. But after that, you know, it's just a part of history. You know, and that now Lord Jamar's going to be known for... His Eminem trolling, his relentless Eminem trolling for six to seven years. And Eminem, it's just, you know, I'm, I'm not knocking him. I mean, you know, he, he's entitled to his opinions. Uh, Crooked Eye said, everybody's entitled to their opinion. Oh, yeah, I didn't even know he said that. And he said, uh, Rock Kim said, he messes with Eminem as a lyricist, but people on my timeline rather talk about how Lord Jamar doesn't. Eminem is a lyricist. I might, you might not love his songs. I, I'm not particularly a fan of every Eminem song, but you gotta recognize the skill in the, you know, putting words together. Is he the best ever? In a particular segment, sure. Is is Nas and Jay Z delivering better music to me? Yeah, I listen to that way over Eminem. So, but can they put words together like Eminem in a different way? You know. Eminem puts words together. Telling stories is totally different. The way Nas and Jay-Z drop knowledge with their lyrics is more of my preference, to be honest with you. But Eminem is great at what he does, you know? So it's just, it's hard to weigh everything out. And that could be a conversation that goes forever. <laughs> but anyways, this is George Tower with JT News. Love you guys and I appreciate you guys. Make sure you tell your loved ones around you you love them. Make sure you be safe. Make sure you take fewer risks. Life is valuable. It's very valuable. And try your hardest every day because every day isn't guaranteed, you know? Sometimes I even forget that, you know? 
So just stop trying to put things off and tackle them. Appreciate you guys, and I'll check you guys in the next one. Love you all. Peace.